And the top GOP member of the House Oversight Committee says it is the height of hypocrisy that Democrats have done nothing to probe reports of voting irregularities in this election year. Here's One America's John Hines. Some uh, ballots are still being counted and there's some legal challenges to some of these ballot counting uh, procedures. What are you attempting to do in light of some election security issues that have arisen? Half of America's furious right now. At least half of Americans are concerned about the integrity of our elections. You see poll after poll that's showing that a big percentage of Republicans don't have confidence that this last election was held accurately. We've had so many hearings in the House Oversight Committee and on the Judiciary Committee, where Jim Jordan's the, the ranking member, over election integrity of the 2016 election, over Russian interference, and just countless hearings. But here we are today. You know, a few weeks after the election, it's still not been determined yet. We're seeing every day irregularities, yet not a single Democrat in the House of Representatives has called for a hearing. And we've had literally hundreds of hearings or discussions on hearings over the past two years about Russian interference in 2016, which we all know was complete fake news. Jim Jordan and I have called for a joint hearing with the Judiciary and Oversight to try to determine what's going on. We want to examine the, the software. We want to examine why certain cities wouldn't allow Republicans in to watch them count the ballots, poll watchers. Uh, we want to understand what happened with the voter rolls and, and the universal ballots in some of these states with people that we've seen may have passed away that somehow voted absentee. So there are a lot of irregularities. Congress should be doing its job. We've had zero hearings this week. Now your committee, I believe, issued a report, tied a report, uh, calling out some of these uh, changes that some uh, Democrats uh, and other, I guess, uh, progressive uh, causes were trying to make with regard to election procedures. Uh, what has been the result of that report and, and what has become of uh, some of the, the, the things that you were warning about? You're exactly right. So we were calling for hearings before the election, Jim Jordan and I. The Democrats wouldn't do that. So our staffs put together a warning call for what we feared would happen. And here we are a few weeks after the election. Everything in that report that we issued a month prior to the election has come true, has come to fruition. We warned about absentees coming in the mail after the election. We warned about certain states like New York and Pennsylvania taking weeks to count ballots to determine the winner in different congressional races and the presidential race, and here we are. So we had hoped that that report would get some state legislatures and some state legislators interested in trying to do something at the last minute, but a lot of these states, uh, even the states that are run by Republican majorities in, this, in their state legislature, they couldn't meet unless the governor called them into session. So you have instances in Pennsylvania where they use that report to file lawsuits, but the, the liberal Supreme Court in Pennsylvania threw a lot of those uh, solutions to the problem out. So now we have the election concluded. There's still so many votes in limbo. There's so many irregularities that we read every day where they're finding new ballots. And lo and behold, these ballots were for Trump, you know? It's just a lot of problems. And to see the Democrats turn a blind eye and refuse to hold any hearings after all the hearings we had on Russian collusion, it's pretty symbolic of the hypocrisy and it's one reason why they lost a lot of seats this past election. Congressman James Comer of the First District of Kentucky, the senior GOP member of the House Oversight Committee, thank you for talking to us on One American News. Always a pleasure. Want to see more videos like this? Visit OANN.com for immediate access to all the clips you've been waiting to see.